I want a free Palestine and a free mind and a free heart and a free world. I want the oceans teeming with life and the air full of plant sex and dragonflies. I want a society where nobody needs to work, but most people want to, except for the occasional eccentric dude. And there's always going to be an occasional eccentric dude, but he will have a flute and a story to tell. I want to write essays at open eyes and poems at open hearts and fan the flames of a revolution that will open the iron fist of the empire. I want to make something so beautiful that people will want to destroy it until they recognise that it's just a mirror of the beauty that hides choked back within themselves. I want a 50th birthday party with a sombre accordion player and his weeping wife who plays the saw. And I want everyone to drink ambrosia cocktails out of teapots and tell each other things that they've never told anyone else before. I want to hand out unconditional flowers at Flinders Street Station and be happy with however they're received. I want to smack that smirk right off Matthew Miller's face and release a swarm of shrieking male cicadas into the press gallery. I want to wink at the moon and have her wink back and then never tell a living soul about it, just keep it a secret between me and her. I want to dance with sincerity, all my psychic armour on the floor like clothing on a night of torrid lovemaking. I want to sing through the soles of my feet and let the earth roar through me like a primordial bagpipe. I want to greet everything that comes into my senses with a wet, gushy love. And I want to be wide open to letting it all love me right back. I want to meet everything that arises with brand new eyes and with more awe and reverence than if I was meeting actual biblical Yahweh. I want plastic to be a controlled substance and for magic mushrooms to be in supermarkets. I want everyone to realise how pervasively we've been lied to and how badly we're being screwed over and what a beautiful world we could all have if enough of us saw it as possible. I want my species to stop living in its head and to finally come back home to Mother Earth. I want a free Palestine and a free mind, a free heart and a free world. Thank you in advance. Love, Caitlin.